had spoken about the intermittent fasting which is gaining a lot of popularity these days. But did you know there's another diet there called the alkaline diet? Well, you're going to hear more about it in a bit. I'm talking about the alkaline diet. What do you think of that? Where did you hear that from? But you're back on. There is an alkaline diet. Actually, this idea behind this is based on the fact that our body uh, produces a lot of uh, acid due to the modern day conception of food that we eat. And increased acidity in our body, it is harmful as in it, it can lead to arthritis, osteoarthritis, liver problems, kidney problems. So there needs to balance out the excessive acidity that's produced by the body during digestion. I'm not very convinced with this diet because, uh, you know, there's no scientific proof or, you know, reasoning behind it. But uh, it's good to be aware of, you know, what are the uh, diets and different kinds of diets. So alkaline diet is basically a diet to counter the acidity in the body. So then alkaline foods. Exactly. What would they be? A lot of fruits, a lot of vegetables, seeds, nuts. So non-citric fruits. Yes, non-citric fr fruits. Mm -hmm. And uh, also cut down on meat cut down on carbs and uh, because these when during digestion produce acid. You're cutting down on meats, you're cutting down on carbs and you have very restrictive fruits that you can eat. What does it leave with? Nothing, that's why I'm not very convinced <laughs> with this diet. But uh, it's for, for a very short term it's okay if one wants to, you can call it fast for a couple of days eating just fruits and you know good vegetables mm -hmm. and avoid everything else. It's for a cleansing, maybe this diet can be followed for a couple of days which I think people do follow when, okay. especially after a very heavy festival period they do go into this kind of cleansing diet which is also the alkaline diet and but then I think for the long run it's a complete no-no mm -hmm. because you're 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 depriving your body of all the essentials you're depriving of protein of carbs of uh, new uh, of your uh, valuable nutrients so I would definitely never recommend it beyond maybe three to four days not more than that okay I'm glad because it really doesn't sound like a very nice diet to be on. I mean, nice in the sense not good for your body. As I said, I'm really not convinced about this diet as there isn't sufficient evidence regarding its benefits. However, what do you think? Do write and let us know.